What is going on guys, Miles here, back again with another video and today we're going to be looking at a preview for the map Precinct in Infinite Warfare Multiplayer, let's check it out. Set in Japan following the invasion of the Settlement Defense Front, Precinct is a medium-sized map that uses grand interiors and the city's back streets as primary locations for combat. Various buildings and billboards provide ample opportunities for advanced movement and vertical engagements, allowing you to move around the map to get back into the action quickly to head off the enemy. Focusing on easy target and enemy recognition, Precinct supports all playstyles while driving frontline engagements. Depending on the mode, you can expect firefights to flare up across the map, so you'll need to learn the sniper sightlines to get in and out of each area successfully. Because of this, we recommend loading out with a close to mid-range weapon to be ready for any engagement. Precinct. Playable in the Call of Duty Infinite Warfare Multiplayer Beta. So that was the first ever gameplay which has been revealed of the map Precinct which is now available in Infinite Warfare Multiplayer. This hasn't ever been seen or played before. It wasn't available at COD XP or Gamescom or any other Call of Duty events. So this is the first trailer we've ever seen of this map and actually it's been released in the Infinite Warfare beta just today. So you can now actually play this map uh, in the beta. So out of the four current maps which we know are confirmed in Infinite Warfare, I would definitely say this is the biggest map out of the four. We have Frontier which is really damn small. There's not a lot of leeway, you can't move about very much, it's just sort of like corridors and you have to fight between them. So Frontier is a really small map and then we have Frost which is based on Europa which I also did a preview on and that one's like a sort of medium sized map. Definitely not as big as this map but definitely bigger than Frontier and the third map we have is called Throwback which I would say is the second biggest map in the game but still submachine guns I would say are most dominant on the map Throwback but it actually looks like on this map Precinct assault rifles and snipers will be the best weapons of choice. As for the design, I would say this is one of the better looking maps in Infinite Warfare. Uh, probably not as cool as Frost because that's based on like a different planet and the colours on that map look absolutely awesome. But the design of this map looks really cool as well. I really like the idea of fighting within a city and having all of these areas which you can like boost jump onto. So I reckon this will actually be a really cool map to play in multiplayer and I can't actually wait to give it a try. Let me know what you think of this map down in the comments below. There we have it. That is the preview of the map Precinct which is now available in the Infinite Warfare beta. Like this video if you guys are excited to play this map. Also let me know what you think of it down in the comments below. And if you guys haven't already, subscribe to the channel for more Infinite Warfare videos. I'm going to be posting a ton over the next couple of weeks. But I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time with a brand new video.